What's going on guys, welcome back to my official channel where Chelsea have just completed yet another small piece of transfer business I'll say. Rob Green has now officially signed for Chelsea, signed a one year contract from Huddersfield. He's a player that we obviously know, he's played for a couple of our rivals as well, West Ham and QPR. He's also played in the Premier League for Norwich and honestly this is going to be a short video because there's not really much to say about it. He's been signed as a backup to Courtois and Caballero. Chelsea have come out and even said done the official statement regarding Green's transfer. And it's honestly not going to be much as that. But to be honest, a lot of people are laughing and taking a piss and saying, yeah, look at you, you've just signed Rob fucking Green. I'm like, it, it does make sense. It makes sense to an extent because he is only going to be here as a number three. He's English as well, so it does fill the homegrown quota. There's not really much I can say that's wrong about this transfer. Like, it makes sense. It makes sense in terms of getting a number three. It makes sense in terms of filling the homegrown quota. So I can't really have much complaints about it. My only real issue is that there's still not long left of the transfer window. And to be honest, I think instead of focusing on the number three goalkeeper at Chelsea, we should be focusing on the number one because we know. Well, I think it's it's blatantly obvious that Courtois is either planning to run down his contract or just force for a move right now and right now is probably the only chance we ever have of getting any decent cash for Thibaut well whatever 35 to 40 million is in terms of decent I don't think that's what he's worth I think he's worth double that at least but with him being with him being down to the final year of his contract if we sell him now we're not going to get a lot for him anyway but my point still stands I'm happy with the Rob Green transfer but for me it's just a case of I feel we should be. Fo I feel like there's other areas that we should still be focusing on more. Midfield seems more or less settled. I'd be happy if we got Golovin, but if we didn't, I'm okay with Loftus Cheek. We've been calling out for the youth to be given more chance, and Loftus Cheek would fit for would uh, fit perfectly as the attacking midfielder in Sari's free in midfield. I feel we also need to be focusing on right in. Uh, we need to be focusing on the right side of our attacking free mainly because. We need to look at someone to take the focus off Hazard. Louis has been talking about Wilfred Zaha. I personally would be down for that as well. I think also one of the areas that we should be looking at is, like I said, goalkeeper as well. And I think there's like pe there's plenty of areas that we need to be looking at. I think number three, this for the time it took for us to get this done, it makes sense. But there's not long left in the transfer window. So whatever we do, we need to do it quickly. So... I just hope we end up getting the players that we need before the window shuts because if the window shuts for us and Madrid are still trying to get Hazard or Quarter and they get one or both and we can't get anyone, it could end up that we're starting the season with fucking Willy Caballero and Rob Green in goal and that's not going to be a great way to start the season. But let me let me know what you guys think of the Rob Green transfer. I personally don't really have nothing against it. But let me know what you guys think. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you very, very soon. Up the Chelsea.